So this is background. Lady Macbeth commits suicide and Macduff kills Macbeth and Malcolm becomes the king of Scotland. So now this is my part of the story. Here it goes. Macbeth tries to commit suicide and the guards catch him red-handed and he was then imprisoned for two years. After Macbeth was in prison, Scotland needed a new king. Therefore, they ran an audition and came up with a new king. A few days later, Lady Macbeth was killed in front of the new king while they were walking side to side going to Fungar. The witches had a really sad news in hand and they had to tell Macbeth about it. Therefore, when Macbeth came, he was told the sad news about he might get murdered and he had to keep an eye out. Macbeth was in shock and he asked the witches who was going to murder him. So therefore he could look out for them. The witches told him that Malcolm is going to become his murderer and he has to keep an eye out for him. Macbeth ran towards the guards and ordered them to kill Malcolm. Then the guards told him that he is no longer the king and they are not going to listen to any of his orders. Therefore he shall get out of there before he gets murdered. Macbeth using all the brain cells he had. He went inside to the court of the king and started putting false accusations on Malcolm. He told the king that Malcolm is gu guilty for theft and murder. The king was new and did not know much about Scotland. He therefore thought Macbeth was correct and he ordered Malcolm to be put in a bronzen bowl. Malcolm could not do anything against the king. Therefore he was put in the bronzen bowl and he was burnt to death. If you're wondering who killed Lady Macbeth, it was Macbeth.